I'm very excited. Today we're doing another mail day unboxing of packages and letters sent to me from you, the subscribers, the viewers, the supporters. And I love doing these kinds of videos because honestly, my favorite mystery boxes to honestly do mystery packages are ones from viewers because honestly, I, I'm always like, have no idea what's coming. And I'm always very excited to see what is in these things every single time. So let's not waste any time and let's do this. So today I got a total of four items. I have two very large boxes. I have, I think one thing from Canada one thing from the UK and then two from the US. Yes. So once again, I have packages from all over the world sent to me, which I think is incredible. Like how cool is that? That like my YouTube channel has reached outside the US. It's reached to a different country, to a different continent. Like how cool is that? So four things. I'm going to do this one first because I've had this one the longest of all the packages. I wanna make sure and not show the person's name or address, um, or at least their address out of respect because who wants a lot of spam mail? This one is from David Wilson, all the way from the United Kingdom. It's, it's kind of like, it's, it's stiff. Like there's something hard stiff in this thing, which I think is, I, this, this could be exciting. So I think actually what's re really, really cool is a fun fact. I checked my YouTube analytic, analytics, can't say that word, analytics. Before I start this video, 13% of my viewers are actually from the UK. For a channel that's based in, in the US to have 13% of your viewers from a different country, that's kind of crazy. You know, that's, that's, that's insane to have that many viewers from a different country. It's awesome though. Okay, I, I want to open this thing up carefully so I don't cut anything that is inside of it. Very carefully. I should have sharpened my knife. I say that before every single video for literally the past six months. I need to sharpen it. Oh, wait a minute. My wife just got four brand new knives in and her room is next to this room. Let me go borrow one of her brand new knives that was sent to her from a subscriber. I'll be right back. Okay, so I grabbed her mermaid knife that she was sent from a subscriber, actually. <laughs> Ooh, it flicks out nicely, though. Let's see, a nice... You can actually can hear it actually cutting. <laughs> Thank you, wife. I borrowed your knife. Yeah, it's actually a really, really cool knife that she got sent to her. You see the blade, the design on the blade. It's actually a really cool knife. But yeah, make sure you subscribe to my wife's YouTube channel. I'll leave direct links to her channel down below and in the, the description box. Also, I actually have a second channel I just started on YouTube. Just started it called Franchise TV, where all my videos are live. Make sure you subscribe to that. I'll leave direct links below to Franchise TV. Also, make sure you subscribe to it because every time I'm, I'm, I'm on there, I'm going to be live where we can actually can interact live with each other. Cool, you know? Back to the unboxing. Okay, we have another sealed package and we have a letter. The wife's knife. Man, this thing's sharp. <laughs> Ooh, it cuts like butter. Here's a letter. David and Kaylee Wilson from the UK. Dear Clint, we've been watching your videos for a long time and we wanted to send you this as a little thank you. Please keep making the videos as it genuinely brings us joy to watch them. We think your wife is just as great as you are and enjoy her channel as well. Thank you for subbing to both our channels. Make sure you subscribe to Franchise TV. <laughs> and that's my last plug, I promise. That's my last plug for my new YouTube channel, Franchise TV. No more plugging. 
We can't wait for more videos. We know you're a huge wrestling fan. We thought you would like the signed photo of a former world champion in the picture he is wearing the NWA World Championship. We know you will love it, and we are happy that it is going to some someone who will appreciate it. We hope that it goes well with your collection. I think the card inside is also signed by Don West, formerly of TNA. Not too sure if he's still with Impact Wrestling. Sincerely, David and Kaylee Wilson. Don West. I actually met Don West uh, last weekend at the AE. W uh, pay-per-view. I met Don West and he did a little promo shot for me. Uh, I actually have it in a video I posted like last week and I'll try to remember to leave a link up here where you can actually can see Don West doing a little promo for me for my video. It's pretty cool but yeah Don West was really fun. He was very loud and boisterous. Very loud. Here we go. Picture time. Who do we have? Oh, that's cool. I like it. We got Christian. Very talented. Awesome wrestler. I was always a Christian fan. I actually don't have a Christian autograph, so this is freaking perfect. I don't have a Christian, so this is perfect. I actually need him. I have two of, you know, like, like his best friend, Edge, Edge and Christian, but I actually don't have a Christian, so this is actually perfect. It completes my Edge and Christian combo that I have now. This is number 104 out of 300, so this is actually a limited edition autographed print out of 300, so that is ultra cool. I like that. There's a card inside of it. It is an authenticity card. Oh, it's from, it's actually from Don West. Official certificate of authenticity. This card certifies that the accompanying TNA 8x10 photo has been personally autographed by Christian Cage under direct supervision of a TNA representative, Andy Barton, the senior vice president and Don West product sales manager. So that's awesome. Thank you so much, David and Kaylee. I really appreciate that. Like I am a huge wrestling fan. I collect lots of autographs and I actually needed a Christian autograph. I needed one. So that is awesome. Thank you so much. That is great. That will go into my collection with my edge. So first one, <laughs> it was awesome. So, I mean, thank you so much, everybody who sends me stuff. Like, you don't have to send me anything. Don't feel like you have to. But anything that I do get, I'm very appreciative of everything that I get. Everything I keep. Thank you so much. I'm always asked, like, how to send me stuff. In every video in the description box, I always leave my UPS mailbox address if you want to send me anything. It's, it's always there. I mean... It's only if you want to send me stuff, no pressure, you know what I'm saying? I'm not pressuring people to send me stuff. But the people who do, I mean, it's it's awesome. It's much appreciated, and I think it's so cool. So this one is from Eric Zimowski, California. We have a letter with something in the letter. There's a Peyton Manning autograph, or a, a card. Okay, there's there's no note or anything in this. It's just a piece of paper, and he sent me a Peyton Manning sports card. Well, that's cool. I actually, my favorite football player of all time actually is Peyton Manning because I'm from um, Indianapolis area, and I always loved Peyton. I was a huge Peyton Manning fan. Try to get the tape off of, of the case. So yeah, I, I will keep this and I will add this into my Peyton Manning collection. So thank you so much to Eric Zamowski from California. But yeah, I'm a huge Colts fan. Um, I love Peyton Manning. Of course, you know, the, all, all the Colts from, you know, yesteryear. Your Marvin Harrison, Edger and James, your Chad Bratsky. Robert Mathis, uh, I can just keep going on and on and on. Uh, of course, the current guys, you know, of course, we all love Andrew Luck and Adam Vinatieri, you know, well, not current, but Reggie Wayne, you know, but, and of course, T.Y. Hilton, fun fact, uh, I ran into T.Y. Hilton actually at a Chinese restaurant here uh, last year. My wife and I were eating at, at a restaurant, and 
T.Y. came in with his wife, kids, and it looked like his mom or his wife's mom. And they sat behind us, and uh, it was just ultra cool that I ate Chinese food with T.Y. Hilton. Not with him, but within like 10 feet away. I had Chinese food with T.Y. Hilton in 2018. Next, let's see. This one is from Canada. Okay, uh, this the person who sent me this only wanted me to say that their name is Randy, and they're from Canada. So thank you, Randy. I do know your full name, obviously, but Randy, thank you so much. Whatever is in this package, I'm sure it's going to be freaking awesome. And it is a very big package, too. So I'm kind of curious what's in this thing. Man, this knife is sharp. I really need to sharpen my knife or just buy a new knife. Ooh, we kind of have a mystery box going on here. Oh, cool. This thing is absolutely full of Funko Pops. Diana, Princess of Wales. Diana, Princess of Wales. Diana, Princess of Wales. And Diana, Princess of Wales. I think I remember his email to me um, a few weeks ago saying that he bought extras of the Diana. He was he was going to send them to me just because he likes my YouTube channel. Oh, this is his shoot me receipt. He bought five of them and he sent four to me. Okay, there's no note in here or anything, but thank you so much. Um, Randy from Canada, this is awesome. So I keep everything that people send to me, I keep it all. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna keep one of these because everything people send me, I keep. I'm gonna keep one. But these three, I'm going to give away. Okay, so if you want one of these for free, comment down below your at Instagram handle or your at Twitter handle, like, you know, like mine's at Franchise Kicks. Comment down below um, at your handle so I can contact you and comment down below, um, I guess, what got you interested in collecting Funko Pops or reselling Funko Pops or, you know, buy, selling, trading Funko Pops and um, I will do a random generator and then I will contact you and uh, let you know that you want a Funko Pop. And I will send it, send you out one totally free of charge. Not bad, okay? But I'm gonna keep one because I keep everything that people send me. So I'm gonna keep one as you know, as a memento from a subscriber package. This one is from from Bob Bretts in Maryland. So I've had this thing now, I think, for about three weeks, so I apologize to Bob. It took me that long to unbox this. I was gone in Vegas for almost a week, and I've just been uh, backed up on video, so I apologize. It took me almost three weeks to unbox this for you, but we're doing it right now. I, know this, I think this was, I think, the longest one that I've had in my possession without unboxing it. So, um, you know, I apologize. I think there actually are a couple of packages at my UPS store right now that I, I need to pick up tomorrow. Uh, I think there's like two there. I think there's two. So if you send me something, it's probably at my UPS store right now waiting to be picked up and you will see it in the next unboxing video on YouTube. Like the next mail day on, on unboxing on, on YouTube. We have a note on top. Clint, big fan of the show. Thanks a bunch for dropping the helpful knowledge on us in a fun, interesting way. Recently, I was at a geek culture convention in Washington, D.C. called Awesome Con, where I was inspired to get the enclosed item for your collection. Hope you enjoy it. All my best to you and the wife. Bob, P.S. I added two more items to fill the box. I'm sure you'll figure out quick which are which with a smiley face. So, thank you, Bob. Let's see what is in here. I got a total mystery box. Okay, so we have three Funko Pops in here. 
also, Bob sent me a Funko Pop mystery box. Let's see, first one. We got Target Lady. The Target exclusive Target Lady. That's a cool one. Give you that 360 view on it. Boom. Yeah, that's cool. Yep. Like, all these pops will not be for sale because, like I said earlier, everything that I'm sent to, that are sent to me from viewers, I keep everything. I don't sell anything, you know. I mean, like, these, I'm, I'm going to give three of these away, you know, because I'm going to keep one, give three away. Comment down below if, you know, you want one of those three. And I'll choose three people. Let's see, next. Oh, this one is in a hard case or a soft protector. I can see it through the bubble wrap. He said, I added two more items to fill the box. I'm sure I'll figure out which are which. Okay, this one is not in a soft protector, so obviously this one must be like the best one. So here's one, no soft protector. Widowmaker Loot Crate Exclusive Overwatch. Widowmaker. That's cool. That's a neat one. And it's it's got the sticker exclusive. Okay, so this will be the last one. This one is like massively bubble wrap and it is in a soft protector. Oh no way. Are you serious? That's awesome. He sent me an autographed Funko Pop from Sergeant Slaughter that's actually signed to me. Oh, he has something to sign too. <laughs> okay, that's <laughs> so cool. Look at that. So he was at what's it called? Awesome Con, and he was inspired to get the item from Mike. So it looks like he must have met Sergeant Slaughter at Awesome Con, and he had Sergeant Slaughter sign this for me. How awesome is that? So this is perfect for my collection. This is perfect. I don't have one of these. So it's signed at ease, Clint, Sergeant Slaughter, WWE. And the side it says Hall of Fame 2004. Bob said that you're a maggot. <laughs> That's funny. That's hilarious. Bob said you're a maggot. One of his catch phrases was he called people a maggot. So <laughs> That's funny. Bob had him right. Bob said that you're a maggot. That's awesome. That is so cool. That is so cool. The thought that Bob put into this for me, this is crazy. This is really cool. Thank you so much, Bob. That is much appreciated. This will be going into a hard case here in just a couple minutes, and it will go with the rest of my signed Funko Pops in my collection. Yeah, this is awesome. Thank you so much. Everybody who sent me stuff, Bob, um, Randy has sent me the four of these. And then to Eric Zimowski from California who sent me the Peyton Manning sports card. And then the first one, David and Kyla who sent me the Christian autograph picture. Thank you so much everybody who sent me stuff. This is fantastic. I mean, this is so cool that people think about me to send me items, you know, people supporting me. So I've got a couple packages to pick up at my UPS store tomorrow. So I'll be doing another mail day unboxing here very, very shortly with some more stuff. So stay tuned and I'll be back. I'm out.